Hey, I'm Andy Garner. And I'm Caitlin Roslin. We're nurse practitioners with Southeast Gastroenterology, and we're here to talk to you about a colonoscopy prep. So today we just wanted to go over some of the tips and tricks uh, uh, to get yourself ready for the bowel preparation. Um, at this point, if you've talked to anybody that's been through the colonoscopy before, or you've been through it yourself maybe previously, you kind of know that the more infamous portion of getting ready is actually drinking the bowel preparation. Um, so today we're just going to go for, through a few things that patients have shared with us uh, that have made their experience better. One of the most common preps that we use in our practice is Suprep. It is split dose prepping. It is six ounces of prep that you pour into the cup that's provided and then mix with a clear liquid of your choice. So the first tip involves kind of mixing your prep up. Uh, one of the most important things that I like to do, regardless of what type of fluid you want to mix with your prep, right here we have a, a sports drink, which uh, I recommend. But regardless, I would say get it cold. Um, having a cold prep goes down much better than having a warm prep. I like to mix mine with just prep, water, and lime. So start by pouring the prep in the cup that was provided. Top it off with some water. We'll slice through a lime here. Give it a good squeeze. And then pour it into a prettier glass. I like using a straw. You can put it in there, bypass the taste buds, and just sip it down. So in my experience, one of the uh, preferred things to do is, uh, of course, use your favorite mug, but uh, hold your nose. It's an old trick, but it really does work in uh, killing some of the flavor. Hold your nose and just kind of muscle through it. Another tip you can do is eating peppermint candy as you drink your prep can kind of help kill that taste. A few other tips to make your colonoscopy prep a little easier are stand while you drink your prep. Because you might need to run to go to the bathroom. Have yourself a pair of uh, comfy pants on hand. No one has time for buttons. Get some baby wipes. And some quality toilet paper. You'll thank us later. Also, you can have some reading material next to your commode. Or a cell phone charger. Because you might be there for a while. And last, it's probably a good idea to have some uh, diaper rash cream available. Also, skip legs that day. Because you're going to be doing a lot of squats anyway. Perhaps the most important tip is to keep this book with you. It has all the vital information surrounding your colonoscopy, including when and what time and how to drink your prep. You want to make sure that you double check your times and read through all the directions a couple of days beforehand because you don't want to do this any more than you have to. Thanks everybody for joining us today. We just uh, really wanted to say thank you to our patients for helping us come up with some of the uh, tips and tricks uh, we've been able to share with you. We hope it makes your uh, preparation experience easier. Call our office today to schedule your colonoscopy. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.